try this one out because I kind of want to get scared, but at the same time, if I get too scared, uh, <laughs> bro, if I get too scared, no, I'm gonna play this through. I'm gonna try to play it through. I'm gonna try. But um, yeah, I think I'm a. Uh, obviously, most of my uh, I do have uh, videos, so I do Twitch and I do YouTube for. YouTube, I do have videos coming up, coming out. Uh, I just need to edit those down, to put them on at UIWJ Ray on YouTube. Um, what else? But yeah, I think I'm gonna start this now, just so I can stop stalling and just get into it. Uh, the game, the way the game is, it was playing more easily. Tinderbox. Bro, I'm playing on normal, bro. I've never played this game. I'm sorry, I've never played this game. <clears throat> I guess we're just hopping into it because uh, yes, our new game. I guess got the headsets on. You know, the lights are off in my room. I'm nervous, <laughs> but we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Don't know why it's called amnesia. Nothing. Don't literally forget. have no idea. Oh. Something must be forgotten. The shadow hunting me. I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at, at uh, Mayfair. What have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is... Yes. I am Daniel. Dang, it's kind of dark now, Cap. I don't know if I should brighten it up. I don't know. We'll see. But my name's Daniel, y'all. I'm Daniel. Bro, I swear I'm gonna have nightmares, bro. But it's fine. It's fine. It's for content. It's for content. It's fine. <clears throat> okay, we're hopping right in. Let's go. Oh, damn. Just starting off like this. Oh, the liquid trail. Oh, Bro, it is just so dark. Bro, I'm already scared. You're lying. Bro, what is happening? I don't know what I'm looking at. How do I open doors? I didn't get no tutorial. That didn't do anything. That, that, that didn't do anything. Uh-huh. Yo. Bro, it just started. This game just started. This game just started. Hold down RT to move right stick through the door. What? Press LB to throw the door open or shut, depending on the door. So I hold it. Oh hell no. Wait. I'm so confused how this mechanic Oh hell no. Okay, wow, that's actually kinda crazy. I don't like that at all, actual. Hold up. I need to turn off the brightness. I cannot see anything, bro. Okay, that's better. Excuse me? Bro, what is that? How do you lean in this? Bro, okay, hold up. I need to see how to lean. I don't understand how the mechanic works. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Bro. Calm down with your breathing, bro, if you don't. God, if you don't. What is happening to me? Get up. Bro, get up, bro. Damn. They're lying. 
Stop with the open doors. I'm supposed to follow this liquid, bro. It's blood, bro. I need to learn how to hide and shit, too. How do you hide? Can I just, like, hide in here the entire game? Oh, damn. You gotta learn how to do that shit fast. What the fuck? What's this? Oh, hell no. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna leave this open. Just in case. Are we going down? We did it. We made it to a room. The other children turned him on. Oh, well, oh, am I really doing this? The young boy thought and struck victim with a rock. Oh. Oh. Bro. Okay. This is so loud. <laughs> Sing unsettling events reduce your sanity. It can be increased by completing puzzles. Bro, that's kind of weird. Bro, I cannot do this though. We're staying in the darkness the same. Super boxes. Okay. 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 How do I turn it on? Pull out my shit. Hold up, bro. Movement, rotate, look. Lantern. That's what I want. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Oh. 19th of August, 1839. I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there'll be anything left after I consume this drink. Don't be drink. afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum. Alexander. Find Alexander and kill him. His body oh. is old and weak, and yours Young and strong. He will be no match for you. So I gotta kill some dude? One last thing. A uh, shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. Your former self, Daniel. Damn. Okay. I'm gonna, like, turn this off for now. I don't know how the shit works yet. What's this? The lantern drains when it is turned on. To add more oil, press A over the oil item. I'm just gonna pull out my lantern. If it gets too dark or if my sanity gets too low, because I should probably start closing doors behind me low key. Wait, what is even my job? No momentum. I 
have no idea what this thing looks like. Hey, okay, damn. already following me in this game, I'm kind of ripped, you know? It's already kind of like GG's. I already hear me. Let's turn that off real quick. What's this shit? I got that. Ah! Look at that. Oh, hell, bro. We're already... We're already moving in, bro. Fragrant taste of rose lingered in his mouth. Turkish delights, he thought. Just like the ones of the conciliate in Scandal. Why is it telling me to do this now, bro? Hold up, is there a way to turn those things on? Hold up. Oh, there we go. That's what that shit was. I don't care. Dog. I can't even stay still. If I stay still, I'm fucked. Fuck. Alexander, is it inside the castle? Bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenberg. Is that Alexander talking to me, bro? Dude, it sounds kind of goofy. I'm just kidding. He sounds cooler than me. I'm not running. Bro. I'm not running. Mainly because... Like candles, other sources, and newer. Current treasure box is showing inventory. Lantern. Tinder box. Okay, where to? Let's ascend. See, there's shit up here. No! Get away from me! You, bro. Stop it, bro. Stop it, bro. Stop it, bro. Stop it, bro. I didn't like that shit. Not one bit, bro. Field shit. Yes. Archives. He fell on the kitchen floor. Tears were beginning to well in his eyes. He received the first kick in his stomach. Hazel reminded hidden. Hazel remained hidden in fear she too would be punished. Punished for what? What is this story? Sixteenth of May, eighteen thirty-nine. The unflinching African star has continued Alexia. to plague Alexia. our expedition, Alexia, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right. But I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought. All night. To 
Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. Cool. I offer my full attention and service to Alexander Baron of Brentburg. This contract will reign for a turn to me. In addition, Alexander will ah. royal court. Oh, then the sanctum of the Order of the Black Eagle. May no man break the seal. Wilhelm, House of Garrick. So what am I exactly looking for, though? Light down there. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my bed, my bed, my bed. Got a lit up room. Let's do this real quick for a little bit. You're lying. Bro, I do not know how to peek shit. Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wards. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Cautious. I'm scared. Great. Love to see that. Love to see that. Um, uh, turn this off a little bit. A little bit. 17th of May, 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. Centuries had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them which haunt slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, 
and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Okay, cool. Cool story, bro. Okay. I'm scared as fuck. Oh my god. I need to stop. I can't tell if that's my footsteps. Oh, it's like... I think I explored everything in here, so I just did. A handful of sand trickled from the crumbling stone ceiling and pushed down on the rim of his hat. He braced the tavern suddenly shifted and settled. So you can descend. I guess I'll descend right here. this door. The stone slab looked like a safety measure. It wasn't meant to be moved ever again. I'm already getting anxiety, bro. Let me just go ahead and, uh, yeah. I hate whatever that noise is, bro. attempt to produce artificial vitae. The former compounds lack the potency I need, but I sense I'm close. Calamine and orpiment are a given, and the cooperite binds them well. This time I will attempt aqua reg regia instead of aqua fortis, and hope it will produce a e more even solution. The experiment was unsuccessful. The solution is highly acid proves impractical to put to any use except as a detergent. Organic tissue reacts especially violently to the solution and should be handled with great greatest care. I might be able to use the recipe, but I'm losing hope that I will find an alchemic solution to my predicament. Yes, give me. No, wrong button. Why am I shaking so much, bro? This can move. What's this? When 
day I'll return. If it wasn't for you, the thought of you, my love, I wouldn't be able to go on. When I find myself doing terrible things, I take comfort in you. As long as I am able to think of you and long for a life together, I know I'm better than the others. I weep for them, they lust for power without restraint. Or I only crave fair judgment and safe return. Bro, why'd I jump, bro? Cool, I found just books. What's this? Uh-huh. I gotta get out of here. I don't know if I did everything, but uh, I did not like that. So, let me just get the fuck out of here. Tired. The sand gave way to his tired body as he fell. The camel's back, he felt the wind gently sweep across his face as his dry crust his lips. Sent we are going. Good to know. Good to know. What do we need to do? So, find the key for the wine cellar. Evidence in the laboratory has revealed that combining four chemicals can create a powerful acid. The door leading to the local history room is locked. Is there another entrance? I need to properly vent the fumes from my most recent experiments as it taking its toll on many of my less stable ingredients in storage. Some seem unaffected, but many are stained by the fumes and will be difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can and move them to the wine cellar. Oh. That's good to know. Chemical ingredients have been moved to the la from the laboratory to the wine cellar. Find the key for the wine cellar. Okay. So we need to find the key of the wine cellar. Does that mean I didn't explore everything in the fucking... Uh, in that one spot? Because I can't go in there. Bro, I swear the monster's in this area over here, dude. I really don't like it in the archives. The archives are scary as shit. Statues were praying, gazing into the dark domed ceiling. Cool story, bro. Why did that shit have to be so loud? Can I oh, I can't open this shit. Fuck. Just some shirts. Oh, I didn't even check these the first time. Bro, I do not like that pickup mechanic. Is this shit? I need this shit. Yay, I didn't notice that the first time. Can I just do that? I don't have any, that shit's ass. What the fuck is this? Fuck? I don't know if that that's important. There's so much maps. Oh, I did not notice it. Bro, that... That shit turning off scared the fuck out of me. Okay. Dude, I'm like on edge, y'all. Don't even... Yeah, it did not need to do that. It didn't need to do all that. What's this? Kingdom Central? Uh... Oh, fuck. Seventeenth of May. What the hell? Thirty-nine. After 
pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. Cool. Oh, am I, am I moving? Oh. It's a nice it pretty light. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my it. fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. And grasped Fuck. firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. It's just a fucking book. Stupid. I'm just saying, like, I do not know where any other shit is. I feel like I explored all this shit. Oh! Okay. Uh, yeah, let me just think this through for a hot sec. Oh. Must find a new way out of this area. Chemical, okay, yeah. Duh, the doy. The doy, bro. Do I know how to get out of here? No. Okay, bro. Oh, wrong button. I'm already out of oil again. But not break with my hand. Watch this. Yeah. Okay, that did not do shit. What is this shit? Oh, hell yeah. I got a helmet? Yes, sir, big brain. Just. Oh, bro. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, Dan. There's some sort of secret door mechanism in the local history room. Okay. Secret door. I'm guessing. Alstelt and Brenberg Castle, 1801. Another region rich with lore and all stuff. Deep within the East Prussian woods, most centuries there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbor, Castle Brenberg, the quiet forest clad mountains, dressed scattered lakes is as picturesque as can be, albeit the area is haunted by the dark. Ask any locals and you will hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travelers should indulge themselves in such conversations, since it will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. All of them have their own twists on the tales, but there are some motives that keep reappearing. So, pages is this? Four pages! Oh my gosh! Okay. Gathers. The story reaches all the way back to the time of the Thirty Years' War. It is said that soldiers who abandoned their duty got lost in cold, dark woods forever damned to roam the grounds. Their bodies wrought by their tainted souls have left them disfigured and empty of essence. Many have sighted them over the years and described them as horrid revenants. They move silently through the woods, shying away from any beholder. 
They are called gatherers, as they seem to follow some ambition to steal living creatures. It is their prey which can be heard struggling inside damp burlap sacks dragged behind them, which reveal their presence. What dark scheme do they follow? A visit undone. Henrik Cornelius Agrippa, the well-known erudite, visited Altstadt at the start of the 16th century. He resided in the local inn for a fortnight as he looked for remnants of kingdom's past. During his stay, all the prominent members of society paid notice, as he has mentioned in many records of the time. One day, he went to investigate a burrow in the northwestern glades, only to never be seen again. Heinrich is known to have passed away in Grenoble some ten years ago, ten years later. He dismissed the notion of ever visiting Allstadt, which makes you wonder what really happened. Who was this mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods? What happened to him? The immortal Baron. The Baron of Brenberg lives a reclusive life with his family at the castle nearby Allstadt, and like most of those noble birth, rumors of her inherited alongside with the title. Researching the history reveals little before the castle was consumed by fire in the late 16th century. It was rebuilt by Alexander, a nobleman from Rhinelands, claiming the role as protector of the Prussian state. Alexander helped the region to flourish and remain popular throughout his, li his presumed lifetime. The family has always been secretive when it comes to lineage and heritage. Therefore, the birth and de death of Alexander, his offspring, has never been fully recorded. This was fed the idea that the Baron is in fact the one, and the same who came from the West over 300 years ago, lived through the time, uh, lived through the time of, the of occupation, and joined the coveted order of the Black Eagle along with great leaders of this country. That was a lot to read. I am turning that on because I know my voice is going to freak out. Okay. Okay. I'm guessing I can get out of here. Okay. It won't open. Cool. A draft and a faint light are coming from behind the shelf. There must be a way in. Okay. If I knew, I would tell you. I don't know. Throw! Okay, well, that didn't work. Oh, I need to hurry. I remember it said that. Or else I need to restart. to do it all really fast. So, one. I found one. I don't know how many there were. There were three that I found. Okay. So, there's... So there's one. Two. that there's a cupboard. Being my smart self, I'm going to do that. Key to the wall. Hell no.
shit. Gazing into the dark dome ceiling, bro. That hurt my heart, bro. That was not a What? Is he chasing me? Bro, what just happened? He is chasing me. Hell no. Nah. Bye. Adios. 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 Which way? This way. Goodbye. I do have the key. Bro, he hit me. Sand gave way to his tired body, he fell. The camel's back. Oh, I already read that part. I already read that. Bro, that was not okay. He could just pop in whenever he wants. Be worse. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. I got you. I got you. I got you. I just need to hurry up and move because. I'm about to go insane, because... I need to find some more oh Shut the fuck up. Bro, what just happened? is happening. I need oil like bad. Uh, uh, uh. Holy shit. It's ink. I only found another tinder box. I need oil. Can't even carry that. Can I not get out of here? No, I cannot. Cool. Sorry I'm being so quiet. I'm just trying to listen to see where homeboy is. Bro, 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 bro. Bro, what is happening? My sanity drops so fast. And there's no oil in here. Can I please open this door? Oh, it feels like 
My chest is going to burst. Oh. My God, Wilhelm, do something! Accept it. We're not getting out of here. Why? How can you say that? Alexander, you piece of shit! Let us out of here! <laughs> Poison? Damn! He just killed some dudes. For real, for real. There's a thing. Okay. Willem's last words. My name is Willem. House of Garrick. These are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I was summoned to the castle of Brendenburg. As most of the aristocracy, I was curious about what this supposed knight of the order could want from me and accepted the invitation. The Baron was friendly and offered me a proposition. It dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sordid, and that the reason I was chosen was because of the follies of my past, and not the honors I've been rewarded with during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim, and do so without asking questions. In return, he would attest to my character at the royal court, advancing my position within noble society. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly and I accepted wholeheartedly. Ever since that day I've brought men, women, and children to Brandenburg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred, none of whom were ever seen or heard from again. Tonight the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. And my suspicious I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us. The wine tasted fine, and my men drank without restraint. So begins the punishment for our sins. The Baron has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I have done. I was weak and fell into his diabolic ways. My men are screaming. Their skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides revolt against our God-given nature. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes, and I can no longer... Damn, I can't even finish. that do? Medical bracer to improve health. And help you. Okay. Bro. Did I pass out of san insanity, bro? Bro, I'm dead. back to the laboratory. I think that's what I'm going to try to do. Okay, let's go make whatever we're supposed to make, I guess. Have 
have to find a way to climb back up. Circular motion with the right stick to turn the wheel. What does this do? I'm supposed to use it here. Bro, I keep pressing the wrong button. Let's go. Okay, well. Oh, shit. It sure is dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now, if you wish. What's the reason? For the darkness, that is. Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Daniel. It's important that you keep going straight, and make sure not to stray. Okay, good to know. Bro, 
It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete orb? Bro, I keep Still finding these things at the worst to times. Continue this journal, even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, and texture, but ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties.
figured it out. Oh, that scared me. I'm gonna put this barrel. a whole weird part that I'm not used to. So I think I'm going to end it here to be honest. Dude. Hold on, give me a second. And then turn on the fucking light. Yo. This game. Okay, well. I have no idea what this next part is about. It seems like a whole nother thing in the freaking water that I'm gonna have to do next time. I have no idea how fast that thing is. Bro, that, this game, bro. Oil is so hard to find and everything. And it gets so crazy when I go insane and shit, bro. Sorry, my heart rate is like pumping. Because <clears throat> I was so nervous that entire gameplay. Um, am I gonna come back to it? Maybe, bro. <laughs> this thing like, scared me, actually. Like, I feel like... I don't know. I, I am literally lost for words for how this game made me feel. But, if I do come back to it... Oh, we're gonna have to deal with that water part. We got through a lot, I, I think. Even though, we, I don't think we even made it to the next whole part of the game yet. I think we're still in, like, the first area because I, had, I got that stuff I couldn't get that stuff off that first door and I think we're gonna end up coming back to try to open that door to go deeper in the, wherever we are the story is kind of unclear to me something I'm my name's Daniel there's this weird guy named Alexander supposedly he killed people uh, apparently I was also I worked for him I guess Pretty much I've gathered so far. That monster thing so far from what I think is slow. So it's kinda easy to get away. I think I only encountered him like twice.
ice. But now we gotta deal with the water. And yeah, the next episode is gonna be crazy because I'm gonna have to try to figure figure a lot of stuff out. But anyways, if you like the video, give a thumbs up. Follow me on Twitch if you're here. If <clears throat> you're on YouTube, subscribe or like. I don't care. Either one's fine. And man, I'm like kind of out of breath in that game. I was holding my breath so much during that whole game. But anyways. Uh, I might do another one, and if I do, I guess I'll see y'all next time. Peace.